Hey, how are you? I'm teacher Manasseh and I'm happy to be with you this time where we are going to have a lesson together and our lesson of today is mathematics. As you remember last time we talked about simple interest is what we saw last time in the previous lesson simple interest remember interest means a profit or a gain we get after investing money in a bank on a saving account or the gain or profit or extra money we pay to the bank after we have borrowed the money from that bank. That's the interest. The simple interest, we said when that rate, a percentage on which interest is calculated, does not change for several years and the principal remains constant for those years we say is a simple interest. Dear friend of mine, we said that a simple interest is calculated based on principal rate and time as our formula, we go to the examples and let's have another example to remind ourselves what we saw last time, how we can calculate a simple interest. Uh, let's say example a man deposited twenty thousand flats in a bank that offers a simple interest rate of 10% for three years. Find his simple interest. A man deposited 20,000 francs in a bank that offers a simple interest rate of 10% for three years. Find his simple interest. What were we given? Let's have the given data. Simply what we have. He deposited 20,000. How do we call this amount? We say it, the money deposited, invested, bought, is called a principal. Now our principal is 20,000 francs. We have interest rate of 10%, the rate, 10%, and the time, which is three years. This man deposited his money in that bank for three years. We want to know how much interest he was given 
after those three years. As a formula, we said that simple interest is calculated by getting a principle we multiply by the rate multiply by time. This is 10 over 100. Now, our simple interest is principal 20,000 times rate 10 over 100 times time 3. So, let's simplify this with this one. Our simple interest becomes 2,000 times 3 simple interest is 6,000 francs. After 3 years, this man was given extra 6,000 francs to what he deposited in this bank. I think you have remembered how we calculate a simple interest. Now today, let's look at how we find the amount, the amount in our terms, amount. Obviously, we know if we say amount means a certain sum, but in the context of interest, what does amount mean? In the context of interest, the amount means a principal plus a simple interest. Or simply, amount means a principal plus interest. Amount. We symbolize it by letter A. I said it means principal. interest. That's what we call amount in the context of our lesson. Having the example, let me take the same example as we have it here. The tatas we have we have our principal as 20,000 francs. We have the rate as 10%. We have time as 3 years. Now we are called to find amount after these 3 years. We have the principal, we have the rate, we have time. They ask us to find or to calculate or to determine the amount. From what we have above, we said that our amount simply means principal plus interest. We have our principal here. Do we have the interest? The answer is no. But as we got it from the previous example, we were to calculate the simple interest. Meaning, the man deposited the money on a simple interest rate. Now, before we get the amount, we need to first calculate the interest as we have already the principal. Our simple 
interest as we saw it simply becomes principal times rate times time. Our simple interest is 20,000 francs times our rate 10 over 100. I think you remember why I write 10 over 100, not 10 percent. As I said, it's better to convert this one into a fraction to simplify the calculations. Now our time is 3. We simplify it and we call this one as 6,000 flags. Now our principal, which is 20,000, simple interest 6,000, we calculate now amount. We say amount equals principal plus simple interest or simply the interest. But in this case, as we are calculated with the simple interest, is principal plus simple interest. Now our amount will be principal 20,000 plus our simple interest 6,000 amount becomes 26,000 flags. Dear friends, remember a man put there 20,000. After tw three years, he was given 26,000. Six extra money. Don't you see that is good? Let's get example number two. If a trader bought 50,000 francs from a bank that charges 5% of a simple interest rate for five years. How much money did he return to the bank. If a trader borrowed 50,000 francs from a banker that charges 5% of interest for five years, how much money did he return to the bank? Remember, we said if you borrow money from the bank, when you are to pay it back, you add the extra money. And we say that extra money is the interest. In this case, we are talking about a simple interest. Meaning that you will give back their money they gave you plus their interest. That's the amount. Here they are asking us to find amount. Remember, by formula, amount means principal plus simple interest. What do we have? Given data. Here we have the principal, 50,000. Plants. We have the rate which is 
percent. We have time five years. Now let's calculate simple interest before we get to the amount from the formula simple interest principal times rate times time. This is fifty thousand flats times five times five of a hundred. Let's simplify zeros together. We are left with five hundred times five times five under flats. Now this is twenty five times five is one hundred twenty five. Add two zeros. Now our simple interest after five years on a rate of five percent, while you're given fifty thousand flats is twelve thousand five hundred. Is the extra money to be paid back? Now our amount as principal plus simple interest. Simply becomes fifty thousand plus twelve thousand five hundred and get amount as sixty two thousand five hundred dollars. Dear friends, have you seen how the banks they get their profit? Sometimes we ask why and how do they benefit? We put there our money. We borrow the money. They hire the workers. How do they pay them? What do they benefit? This is their benefit. On 50,000 flags they gave you, after five years, on this rate, you pay extra 12,500 francs. Remember, there are many clients or customers who are always there and they get that profit. Are you ready to form a bank? Maybe it's a business. You can make it and you get money like others. And it's profitable. Hoping that those who are interested, they will keep on studying, studying. They make a project, then they hire the experts, and you make your own bank so as to make this business. I thank you very much for your kind attention. See you next time. Bye-bye.